Mahilo ka na ba dahil matihirap ang lessons mo? Math, dali lang yan! Mag-subscribe ka lang sa channel ko at malalaman mo that math is fun! Hi everyone! Kumusta kayo? Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another math daling lesson! So as I mentioned on my last video, for today we're gonna talk about prime and composite. But before we proceed to the discussion proper, I'm gonna give you first the definition of prime and composite. I'm gonna flash it on the screen. Prime are whole numbers greater than 1 with only two factors, 1 and itself. On the other hand, composite are whole number greater than 1 with more than two factors. And if this is the first time you're gonna watch on my video and you have no idea what factor means, I did a tutorial on factors and multiples on my previous video. I will just gonna put down on the description box the link on my previous video about factors and multiples. So actually, instead of just discussing prime and composite, I come up with an idea to just discuss to you how to identify prime and composite numbers from number 1 to 100. So if you are interested, please keep on watching. So as you can see on your screen, I have here a table with numbers 1 to 100 and then there's three boxes here with the word prime, neither, and composite. The prime box is colored with blue and the neither box which indicates neither prime nor composite is colored with red and the composite box is colored with yellow so these colors will indicate whether a number from 1 to 100 is prime neither prime nor composite or a composite number so let's start with one so is one a prime or a composite so actually one is neither prime nor composite that is why we're gonna color it with red Proceeding with 2, 2 is a prime number because the only factors of 2 is 1 and itself. So it belongs with prime number. And just to give you a trivia, all even numbers are all composite except 2. It means that all the numbers from 1 to 100 that ends with 2, 4, 6, 8 and 0 which are all even numbers will be colored with yellow so we're gonna start with 4 let's color it with yellow followed by 6 so 6 will be colored by yellow and then 8 and also 10 So all numbers here below 2, which the last digit is 2, are all composite. So it will be colored by yellow. So all the number here that ends with 4 are all composite. And we're going to color it with yellow. And so with the numbers below 6, which ends with 6. And then all the numbers that ends with 8 are also even numbers, which means they are composite. Let's color it with yellow and then the numbers that ends with zero are all even numbers and it means that they are all composite so as you can see all even numbers from 1 to 100 except 2 are all colored with yellow because they are all composite okay so let's proceed with 3 is 3 prime or composite so the factors of 3 are 1 and 3 only. It means that 3 is a prime number. So we're going to color it with blue. Then after that, we're going to skip count by 3 and all the numbers that are multiples of 3 are all composite. So we're going to color it with yellow. So that's 1, 2, and 3 which is 6 is already colored with yellow then 1, 2, 3 so we're gonna color 9 with yellow 
means that it is a composite. 1, 2, 3. So 12 is already colored. Let's proceed with 1, 2, 3. So 15 will be also colored with yellow. And then 16, 17, 18 is already colored. 19, 20, 21 will be colored with yellow because it is a multiple of 3. And then 22, 23, 24 is already colored. 25, 26, 27. We're going to color it with yellow. And then 28, 29, 30 is already colored. 31, 32, 33. We're going to color it with yellow. 34, 35, 36 is already colored. So 37, 38, and 39 will be colored with yellow. And then 40, 41, and then 42 is already colored. Let's proceed with 43, 44, 45. We're going to color it with yellow. And then 46, 47, 48 is already colored. 49, 50, 51. So we're going to color it with yellow. 52, 53, 54 is already colored. 55, 56, 57. Let's color 57 with yellow. So 58, 59, 60 is already colored. 61, 62, 63 is also a multiple of 3. That is why it is a composite. And then 64, 65, 66 is already colored. 67, 68, 69 will be colored with yellow. And then 70, 71, 72 is already colored. 73, 74, 75 will be colored with yellow. And then 76, 77, 78 is already colored. 79, 80, 81 will be colored by yellow. And then 82, 83, 84 is already colored. So 85, 86, 87 will be colored by yellow. And then 88, 89, 90 is already colored. Let's proceed with 91, 92, 93 will be colored by yellow. And then 94, 95, 96 is already colored. It's composite and will be colored by yellow. Okay. Once again, 3 is a prime number, but all the multiples of 3 are all composite. Next is 5. So is 5 prime or composite? So of course, it is prime number because the only factors of 5 are 1 and 5. So we're going to color it with blue. And then we're going to skip count by 5 and all the multiples of 5 will be colored with yellow because they are all composite. So let's count. So from 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 10 is already colored. And then 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 is already colored. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 is already colored. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. We're going to color it with yellow because it is a composite. Next is 26, 27, 28, 29, 30 is already colored. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So we're going to color it with yellow. And then 36, 37, 38, 39, 40 is already colored. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45 is already colored. 46, 47, 48, 49, 50 is already colored. 51, 52, 53, 54. We're going to color 55 with yellow. Okay, so 56, 57, 58, 59, 60 is already colored. Then 61, 62, 63, 64, 65 will be colored by yellow because it is a multiple of 5 and it is a composite. 66, 67, 68, 69, 70 is already colored. 71, 72, 73, 74, 75 is already colored. 76, 77, 78, 79, 80 is already colored. 81, 82, 83, 84. We're going to color 85 with yellow. And then proceeding with 86, 87, 88, 89, 90 is already colored. 91, 92, 93, 94. We're going to color 95 with yellow. And then 96, 97, 98, 99, and 100 is already colored. And then... We're going to proceed with 7. So once again, 7 is a prime number because the only factors of 7 are 1 and itself, which is 7. And we're going to skip count again by 7 and all the multiples of 7 are all composite. So we're going to color it with yellow. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 14 is already colored. So 15. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 is already colored. So 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28 is already colored. 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35 is already colored. 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42 is already colored. 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. We're going to color 49 because it is a multiple of 7. So it is a composite and will be colored with yellow. So 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56 is already colored. 57, 58, 59, 60. 61, 62, 63 is already colored. 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70 is already colored. 
71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77. So we're going to color 77 with yellow. 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84 is already colored. 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. So we're going to color 91 with yellow. So 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98 is already colored. So all the multiples of 7 are already colored. And then, as you can see, there are still uncolored boxes so all those boxes that was left are all prime numbers so we're gonna color it with blue so let's color it with blue so 11 13 17 are all prime numbers and so with 19 23 29 31 and then 37 is also a prime number. 41, 43, 47 is a prime number also. And then 53. We're going to also color 59 with blue because it's also a prime number. So also 61 is a prime number. So also 67 is a prime number. Let's also color 71 with blue. That indicates that it is a prime number. Also 73, proceeding with 79, and also 83. 89 is also a prime number. And finally, 97 is also a prime number. Okay, so now you can see the results. As you can see from numbers 1 to 100, we only have 1, which is 1, neither prime nor composite. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25 prime numbers. We have 74 composite numbers from 1 to 100. Okay, so this concludes our lesson for the day. If you learned something because of this video tutorial, please give this video a thumbs up. And you can also share this video to your friends and classmates. And for more math tutorial videos, please do subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell so that you will get a notification every time I uploaded a new video tutorial. Thank you so much for watching and see you on my next Math Daling lesson!